Over the last six years, the liqueur project has raised the extraordinary sum of over one and a half million pounds to be used for research into improving the cure of breast cancer here at the Royal Marsden Hospital. We're very lucky because in this hospital, right in the heart of the hospital, we have modern state-of-the-art laboratories and we've also got more just adjacent to us in the Institute of Cancer Research. And that gives us the tremendous advantage that doctors and scientists can work alongside each other on a day-to-day -day basis to carry out the critical research that we believe is necessary to achieve our aim. For example, the great majority of breast cancers have oestrogen receptors in them and they thrive on oestrogen. And a major form of treatment is therefore what we call endocrine therapy, which is simple drugs to block oestrogen. And that approach has cured enormous numbers of patients. But it doesn't always work. Why? Our scientists have used liqueur funding to show that there are genetic mutations in some cancers right at the start that enable them to be resistant to oestrogen. Some cancers respond very well to endocrine therapy at first, but then eventually the cancer comes back. Our liqueur scientists have developed a very powerful new tool called liquid biopsy, which is increasingly used around the world. And this enables us with a simple blood test to detect at a very early stage genetic mutations in the cancer. And that in turn enables us to tailor the appropriate treatment for the individual patient, something we've never been able to do before. Our results so far have been published in top international journals around the world. And they've enabled us to develop a program, a plan of research going forward over the next five years. But this means that more than ever, we need your support to enable us to fulfill our goal of curing breast cancer in everyone. So thank you very much for your support.